snug. Really, an extra yeah. large? Yeah. I've never, worn an ex, I've never worn an extra what's large. That, anything. What's that make me? I'm feeling pretty good. I hope good. there's a triple X on board. Yeah, if I'm wearing an extra large, what would Sam, my cameraman, have to wear? a triple or a quad X. Whoa, <laughs> Sam. <laughs> Hey everybody, Chip Hanauer, the boat guy. Not happy, not happy this morning because I'm at Carroll on Point, that's okay, but I'm gonna go wakeboard. Come on, a 59 year old skinny guy trying to get up on a wakeboard, I hear it's really hard. But Seafair has the Hyperlite wakeboard competition. They said, hey, get out there, go wakeboard and tell us what it's all about. I got Greg Young from Northwest Riders. He says he can get anybody up on a wakeboard. We'll see. And you think you can get me up on a wakeboard? It takes no muscle. That's why I'm not. I don't have my shirt off. It's embarrassing. You, you need no muscle. Why did you bring that up? <laughs> Greg, you said getting up on a wakeboard is kind of analogous to when you go down in football or soccer, and your buddy teammate comes over to help you up. Tell, tell me about that again. Yeah, so it's the same idea. What, what the boat's really doing, just like your friend or your teammate would do on land, I'm rolling you over your feet. Once your body gets over your feet, it's your job to stand up. So if, I, if I get so, knocked down in soccer, I would go like this. So what's going to happen is I'm going to roll you forward. Your chest hits your knees. Yeah. Your butt's going to slide to your heels. And all I'm doing is rolling you up over your feet. That's it. Huh. Yeah. All right, here we go. It's, uh, it's about 10 in the morning. It's about what time I usually get up. But not today. I'm going wakeboarding. From this position to that position underneath you is the most important part. So I'm just gonna go really slow until I see that happen and then I'll start to accelerate. Too much drag, just let go of the handle. I don't have brakes. Ready? All right, nice and easy, here we go. What you did is you went kind of prehistoric and you got what I call the T-Rex arms. So you pulled in and gave it the, the old T-Rex. So what I want to have happen is just have your handle drop a little bit lower to your hip. You kind of want your back arm straight across your body and then just drop your knees down. Stay in a ball. It's like Greg said, don't try to help yourself. Just stay in a ball. Next thing you know, you're up. Once you're up, um, it takes a little bit of time, but I think within a day, I could be catching some air. What do you think? Yeah, I think you'd probably go pro by this afternoon. We'll sign the paperwork. All right. Greg, I've got to apologize for the attitude when I got here. Um, but no they really did. Everybody scared the hell out of me. They said it was super hard. It wasn't all. You're a great teacher. I really appreciate it. Sure. Who else do we need to thank you for giving me this opportunity? This well, is great. There's a lot of good local companies involved um, in wakeboarding and in the Seafair um, Hyperlite experience. So Hyperlite Wakeboards, obviously, um, that's what you were riding on today. Taiga Boats is the boat you're sitting in right now. And then Linwood Motoplex up in Linwood sells the board, sells the boats, and they help us out a lot too to help other people get out on the water. What if people want to come and do just what I did, learn and just have the first experience, how they do that? Yeah, there's a couple of different options. You can go to wakelessons.com, which is uh, which is my website. That's uh, how you'll find me and I'll teach the wakeboard lesson. We can rent boats out of Kirkland too. We've got a, a website called waterfrontadventures.com uh, as well. And we'll just hand you the keys to a boat. You can go out and try it on your own with your family. Greg, nobody just hands me the keys to their boat. Have you seen what I've done? I, I have, yeah. I, I don't know. I think there's a few extra pieces of uh, paperwork I'd have to have you sign. But, yeah. <laughs>